What do Yankees D.D. Gregorius and Martin Guptill have in common? Well, they're both talented strikers of the ball and they both love baseball. Sam Gregorius, deep to right. Of course, when two sporting athletes come together, you always need a good PR stunt to get the word out. So this is, this is the special sauce that makes Steve me. So this is like a taste of the ocean. Meeting Abraham was pretty cool. You know, he was a really nice guy and, and made us feel very welcome at, at his restaurant there and put on a little uh, little spree for us. You know, some beautiful food that he makes it. <laughs> Come on! Come on! Made me feel a lot better that Didi didn't like oysters as well. I'm not a big fan of oysters, just saying. <laughs> not a big fan. I'm not a big fan. <laughs> yeah, I think we got away with, uh, with that one. See you, now, what we're all wanting to see is if these big hitters can match it in each other's sporting worlds. Right in the slot for Martin Guptill. So when it goes over like that, it's what, six, six points? Six, six runs, yeah. Six runs, right, and when it bounces over, it's two or four? Four. Four. So you can see, we get to hit 360 yeah, right. rather than just uh, straight out in front. And here on The Cricket Show, we were able to create this strange crossover at the launch of a pop-up baseball batting cage at Auckland Silo Park. Guess first and foremost, Bat's a little bit different, isn't it? Way different. You reckon you could hit a few homers with that? I mean, probably. We'll give it a try. Watch out. Probably call that one a base hit. Not bad. I mean, it's kind of like baseball a little bit. The only thing that's different, the ball's bouncing. You know, he's striking it really nicely and, you know, obviously baseball and cricket are pretty similar and obviously hand-eye coordination is a key thing, so, you know, he's going very well at the moment. He's picked up the bouncy ball quite quickly. All right, Didi, we've got one more here. you got to hit a home run. I'm going to hit a home run? Yeah. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah, that'd be pretty close. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a bad start, that. The only thing that's different now, too, is the, the bat. <laughs> It's bigger, and baseball is just round, and uh, you have more chance to hit the ball all over instead of just baseball. I just took a shot at cricket. I don't think it was bad, but I'll give you a shot of my world. Let's do it. All right, Let's go. you ready for it? Absolutely. All right. Yeah, I'm a really big fan of baseball. Uh, I, I watch you know, as many games as I can uh, during the off-season uh, with cricket. So, you know, when I'm at home, I try to catch a couple of games a week. And then, uh, you know, when I'm overseas, I, I watch all the, all the highlights on MLB TV. So, um, you know, I, I tend to watch them quite a bit. A number of cricketers are fans of baseball. I know there's a couple of guys in the current setup that are pretty big on it, and also, you know, a fair few uh, past players, you know, like so Daryl Tuffy, Shane Bond, Scott Styrus, Jacob Borum, Daniel Vittori, you know, they were all, uh, you know, well into it, and they all play um, fancy baseball against each other. Good. Quickest is the only thing that's different. You throw it from the top now in baseball, so he still has the same uh, good hand and eye coordination, so uh, I don't think that's much different there. D.D. Gregorius has come over from the States to our shores to create baseball awareness across the country. I'm feeling the ground ball. I'm going this way. The kids' faces, they get to see somebody that's on, on TV, on, on Sky Sport, and the, the guy that, that replaced Derek Jeter, although he'll tell you he never replaced him, he's just playing on a, on a team with, a, with another eight guys. The, the look on their faces is unreal, and, and you can see them really open up. For me, it's just giving them a lot of much knowledge, as I know. You know, tell them, too, there's, uh, there's future and to represent in, you know, your country, you know, so uh, you get down here, we get to play baseball in the States, we represent New Zealand on your chest. You know, it's a, I mean, if you get a chance to do that, that's an honor. Oh, five ball. Before we say goodbye, I've got a little uh, gift for you. I've got one of my uh, One Day International playing tops. Nice. Number 31, Gupta, nice. so uh, thank you very much. Hey, thank you, man, thank and you, thank you very much. Enjoy your time in New Zealand. I will, definitely will.